following breaking news out of Roseville, where police say a woman was attacked and stabbed at a bell tire. Shortly after that, a man was stabbed near 12 Mile and Harper. That suspect still on the loose. Joining us now live is Andres Gutierrez, who's in Roseville following this developing situation. Andres? Yeah, Terrence, right now is still an active scene here. Detectives have finished gathering evidence. In fact, right now the fire department is clearing, washing away where the attack took place, right next to the area where you fill your tires with air. Uh, there, as you said, there are two stabbings apparently done by the same man, so there is apparently an active manhunt here, and here's what we know so far. Take a close look at this man who Roseville police say is armed with a four inch hunting knife and is driving this dark colored Chevrolet HHR with a chrome front end. They believe he attacked a woman at this bell tire on Gratiot as she was filling her tire with air around six this morning. Officers found the victim unresponsive with several stab wounds to her body. As investigators process the scene here in Roseville, detectives are also working with St. Clair Shores Police, who also responded to a stabbing this morning involving the same suspect. The suspect, according to police, is a white man, approximately six feet tall, weighing about 160 to 180 pounds with short blonde hair, last seen wearing a red sweater and brown pants. Of course, the suspect is considered to be armed and dangerous. Anyone with information is being asked to call the Roseville Police Department at 586-777-6700. Reporting live in Roseville this afternoon, Andres Gutierrez, CBS News, Detroit. Andres working quickly and diligently behind the scenes for us to bring us those updates. Andres, we appreciate it. This is a developing situation, one that we will continue following for you, bringing you those updates minute by minute over the air and online at CBSDetroit.com.